532 is the time. Our back to school coverage begins as many students make their way back to the classroom for a new academic year. One district returning today is East Syracuse Manoa. News Channel 9's Ashley Kafaro joins us live from the district's transportation center with more on the new school year. Hey there, Ash. Hey there, Ryan. In just a few hours, students will be getting on the bus, making their way back to the classroom to begin the new school year. And with me this morning is Dr. Donna Desiato, the superintendent of East Syracuse Manoa Central School District. Thanks so much for joining me this morning. Good morning. How do you feel? It's the first day of school. Excited. Excited. It's always a very exciting day to have the first day. We're looking forward to a Spartan Spectacular Day here at ESM, and we're really looking forward to seeing our students return. That's great. Now, would you say this year is a normal year compared to previous years with COVID? I would say certainly it's more normal with regard to what most students and parents uh, expect or are, are accustomed to. Uh, it will be a maskless environment unless it, uh, a student or a staff member chooses to wear a mask. Those are optional. Uh, there will not be any required testing this year. However, we are offering testing, both a pool type swab testing on a weekly basis with our school nurse or we have test kits available for families as well. And can you tell me more about ESM starting full day pre-K this year? I know that's exciting. Very exciting. This is our first year of having full day pre-K. Uh, we have 90 seats for full day pre-K and then we have all of the other seats are available half day. We have a universal pre-K so it's a very exciting day for our pre-K this year with our first full day students. All right, thanks so much, Dr. Desiato. Again, today is ESM's first day of school. Live in East Syracuse, Ashley Cafaro, News Channel 9. Okay, thank you, Ashley. Back to school means finding that back.